I see walls as a surface that absorbs the changes that happen in every city, every day at every hour. I see walls as an archaeologist sees something that they can study and that they can reflect on. Macau is very interesting because you have a lot of different architecture, a lot of the contrast between the old and the new. When I carve a wall here, I can see history, I can see layers, I can see time, and that's why it really inspires me. My name is Alexander Farto, I'm also known as Vils, and I'm from Portugal. I basically create an artwork by carving and destroying the surface of the walls. I started when I was 13 years old, doing mostly graffiti and illegal walls, but the work evolved to what I do today, which is much different from graffiti. One day I arrived to a conclusion that why am I adding to a wall? Why, why should I not work with what's already there? I usually go and I film the city, I photograph, I draw a lot, and I gather several portraits of different people. And then I go and choose the walls. I first paint it with graffiti and sketch the different depths. And then that allows me to go to the wall and then carve the day after. I never know how the work is going to look because each wall has their own way of behaving. So in the end, I don't know the result. And I like that. I like the fact that the wall actually detects the final result of the artwork. Macau is a very particular place. It's a place where you have old murals, graffiti, advertising. And this is something that inspires me a lot because the work tries to work with what's invisible, what's inside the walls of the city. I feel very happy when people have a good reaction. It's very pleasing to hear different opinions and interpretations of your work. People see their own ideas, concepts and feelings. I think that's very interesting for me. This is always what drives me forward. <laughs>